Hey everyone, long time no see. This is Ariana Jolie. The reason as for the long time no see is because I have been, I swear every video I post is an excuse, but this is a legit, this is like an, a, a legit, cons <laughs> this is a legit excuse. Like this is a legit excuse for my inconsistency guys, I swear. I've been admitted to the hospital the past la couple weeks ago. Not for anything too serious, it's I have been suffering from viral meningitis and I have the symptoms right up here to prove to you guys that I was not stable enough to uh, do any YouTube videos, Not and I honestly, I've been dying to get myself on camera and film something for you guys and I'm still like at the end stages of my meningitis and I still am not all the way there. I get bad headaches still i have to pop some tylenol yeah, i'm still not all the way there yet but i am slowly getting there like i'm i'm slowly getting better if you want a story time like you can have one but i'm about to give you a brief like story on my experience at the hospital because i never in my life never in my life have i stayed overnight in the hospital ever um because overall i'm a healthy person like i don't know where i got this meningitis from i don't i really don't like it, it must have been in the air it must have been the germs must have been on the on some money I touched. It must have been I don't know because nobody around me like was sick, and I stay alone like for the most part. Like I'm not around people 24/7. So how do how did I get meningitis? I have absolutely no idea. But I at the same time I can't complain. I'm blessed because as I don't have bacterial meningitis, and bacterial meningitis is what kills you. Viral meningitis uh, keeps you alive. If you want to read up on it, go ahead. All the information's on Google. But that was my excuse. Really sensitive to light, so the fact that I'm sitting here in front of this bright ring light is is you need to give me a pat on the back. I'm not trying to be cocky or nothing, but I'm doing this for y'all. My eyes are kind of hurting already, and I haven't even started my makeup yet. So wish me luck. <laughs> That's my little excuse on on why I haven't been active. I've been sick with meningitis. And it hasn't been fun at all. It really hasn't. It really hasn't. I've been sleeping like it makes you really tired. It gives you the worst headaches. Your eyes are sensitive to light, sensitive to sound. You're sensitive to sound. You're sensitive to everything, and it really does suck. But what can you do? I'm trying to just get over my my battles, my 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 sickly battles. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I know you're tired of hearing me ramble. Let's get to the point of this video. It's December 1st. Well, I'm filming this December. I'm filming this December 1st. That this most likely will be up either tomorrow, December 2nd, or December 3rd. I wanna do a nice holiday look for you guys with all new makeup. Obviously, I don't have all new makeup. I have like mainly like eyeshadows and I shop from Beauty Bakery. Uh, Gerard Cosmetics sent me a PR package and I would love to show you guys what was included in that and just a lot more. Mainly everything is going to be uh, brand new. But if you like to see that video then just keep on watching but before we get started make sure you hit that subscribe button. We did hit 2400 subscribers so thank you guys so much. We did hit it before uh, December and I'm so excited. Oh yeah, thank you guys so much. Just keep spreading the word. You know, I'm trying to I'm trying to get up there, you know what I'm saying? Cuz it's about that time. I've been doing YouTube for 5 years now. So, it's a, it's a, it's about that time I start getting up there. Um especially if I'm going to start being consistent and stuff. So, yes, just um subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell. Let's just get started. <laughs> Shall we? Okay, so I've had this base, this P. Louise base for like a year now, over a year. I'm, I'm gonna use it to prime my eyes because it's a nice light base and you can't go wrong with light bases because if you want to do a colorful look, it will pop up bright. If you want to do a neutral look, it will pop up bright. Guys, if you have experienced the pain and the misery of meningitis, viral meningitis to be specific because bacterial kills you, let me know in the comments because please like let me know so I can have somebody to relate to because I'm still, like I said, struggling to get over the illness 
and I can't take it anymore. I have a new item to show you guys. I can blend it out with a new item that I have bought. Okay, so I never opened this box yet. <laughs> I received it like two weeks ago. Three, three weeks ago? Yeah, and I never even opened it. That's my problem. Like I order stuff and I don't even open, I don't even open it when it gets here. Like what's my problem? But anyway, this is a beauty bakery package that it's not PR, I'm not on their list. I just ordered it uh, with my own money. Well, let me open the package because these boxes be playing with me. Like I, I don't have a time. But why do they make these boxes so difficult to open? Okay, so that's beautiful besides this little part that I have ruined with the screwdriver. Um, so this is what the inside of the packaging looks like. And isn't this adorable? Oh my God. This is the uh, Beauty Bakery setting flower powder. Isn't that beautiful? Like look at that packaging. It literally looks like a bag of baking flour. Like I don't want these pink things to fly everywhere. Like I'm, that's why I'm being so cautious. I got the, I got the black six piece blending eggs and ooh, it matches my shirt. <laughs> All right, but I got the uh, black blending eggs because I, the first one I bought was uh, like last year or something. I got the colorful ones, the teal and the pink. And now I just want it to be aesthetically pleasing, I guess, and get all black. And I did. I love it. I love, 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 love it. Like I've had a weird obsession with, with gray and black lately because like, you can tell by my shirt, I'm wearing gray and black uh, tie-dye. I just love those, like, I don't know. It's just my style lately. Like, I'm not emo or gothic or anything. I just really like black and gray and white. Like, the whole no color. Like, I really, I'm really vibing with, with that lately. Here's an old water bottle in front of my face. I'm gonna wet it. Try to be careful because I'm not trying to make a whole mess to clean up or because I have carpet. I don't have wood floors, so hopefully it doesn't seep into the carpet and get moldy and shit and ew. Okay. I'm just going to do a little so that it can get puppy. Oh, uh, this is good enough. I'm not about to ruin my room and get it wet and stuff, so I got it damp enough you know not the whole thing is not completely damp but it's all good in the hood so let me i bought this a while ago i just never filmed a tutorial with it um or never showed it on camera well i did i think i did but i never like used it on camera but i have the colored rain Safari palette, isn't this a Safari? Safari rain palette, this is the, the Safari palette. I'm gonna use this today for a nice Christmassy holiday festive look. So part of me really feels like this palette is perfect for the holidays. It's perfect for a lot of things too, cause it has a lot of like shimmery shades, colors, um, and everything. So I cannot wait to use this. I feel like it's necessary to take this one uh, this is the Matriarch shade, and this is going to be my transition, like my first color of the transition in the crease. Oh, let's go. Let's get this over with because it is currently 8.12 p.m. And I'm in, at night, not in the morning, and I want to go to bed at a decent hour. Oh my god, satisfying. <laughs> This is so easy to blend. Like, I'm trying to blend this out and it's blending like literally flawlessly. So the next shade I'm gonna take is the clay shade. And that is the orange one right here. Um, I'm just gonna put that above the transition. This definitely needs to be darkened up, so I'm gonna take some black later on. Uh, there's no black in this palette, so I'm gonna take an, a different palette. I'm just gonna take the Juvia's Place Saharan palette, and I'm just gonna take the black in that. I'm just using this like little thin shader brush, trying to get the details in there. I'm going to take the Amazon Basin shade in the palette, and I'm just going to take my finger and apply that all over my lid. Yo, this is so pretty. 
then like over top, I'm gonna apply a little bit of the gold shade. I'm gonna apply that like right on top. Try to blend the two together. It's, oh my gosh. As soon as I touch the shade, like it literally, like, oh my God, just look at the, look at the pigmentation. I'm gonna use this Rimmel Scandalized Bold Highliner. And I am just going to line my eyes and do a wing. <laughs> Here's my little wing, something, you know, it's just something. Like, cause like, I can't do a wing that great because my meningitis is just very, it's causing my hands to shake and stuff and I don't know, but I tried my best. Okay guys, so since I am done with the main part of my eyes, I'm gonna move on to my face. And for face, I already do have this, um, it's not new. I have the Maybelline Master Prime. I'm gonna prime my face with that. Foundation, I'm gonna take the Juvia's Place I Am Magic Foundation because that is my favorite ever. I already have is the Makeup Revolution Concealer in C12 and I'm about to highlight all my areas that I need to highlight under my eyes, my forehead, all that stuff. Okay, so a new product that I'm gonna use is the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder. And, ooh, that's a little too bright. I want you to have more color to you. So I'm gonna take the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder, and this is the banana one. Let me just open up the package. Okay, so this is what the product looks like. I'm gonna use the same Beauty Bakery blending sponge to uh, apply that to the areas are so pretty. I really love the packaging. So I'm gonna shake this up a little and um, then get the powder out of it. I'm just gonna set my face. Ooh, that's a little too bright. say this powder is a little too bright for my liking um but at the same time I love how it blends into the skin like I really do um, even though it's really bright I like how it blends into the skin so I'm taking the black radiance um, contour palette and I'm just gonna take the middle shade in there just this one this light brown one or I, I might like combine the two I might like mix the two and then contour my face Gerard Cosmetics sent me a PR package. Well, um, basically I get to pick out my own makeup. Um, they don't like pick out the stuff they, you know, and send it to me. I pick out my, I, I like basically, it's like I'm shopping on their site, but it's like, you know, they send it to me. So, um, if that makes any sense. But this is the package, I already opened it, as you can see. But I'm gonna show you some of the things that I received. Um, this is the highlight palette, I think. Um, so I might use this. This looks all luxury, but um, yes, this is how the packaging looks like. It's like a mirrored gold um, compact that says Gerard Cosmetics, and I may just use it for this video. Um, I like how you can like take the plastic, it doesn't even come off. Like you can just like open it, close it, open it, just to protect the uh, the highlight. I like that. I'm just gonna use this highlight brush. I have, I have this, I had this for like two years. Hopefully this looks good on me. Ooh. 
shows up like when you turn your head. Not so much when you're like looking forward, but it's still really pretty. Beautiful. So I'm gonna move back to the colored rain palette and do my lower lash line for the eyes. And I'm basically gonna like repeat like the colors that I have for the transition. So like uh, Matriarch, this uh, brown one right here, and then the orange one up on the top. All right, so I'm taking the ColourPop Cream Gel Liner, and this is in Swerve, I believe. All right, I'm going back in with this shade right here, Amazon Basin. I'm just going to pop that into my inner corners. Isn't that beautiful? I'm gonna take the Lash Envy, this is just the Lash Envy like trio, and I'm gonna take the style Monaco, Monaco right here. So while I'm waiting for my lashes to dry, because all you can see this is still like showing, it doesn't dry down, I'll just go over it with liner. But I'm gonna pick the lipstick, and I'm deciding between like a red or like a burgundy or something. Ooh, this one's like a reddish burgundy. That's something that I might wanna wear. Let me swatch it. That's an option. This one is just a lipstick. I don't remember what color I got, but let me open it. It's like a little bullet. It's in the shade London Fog. Right there, it's like a purpley gray. This one's like a pretty red. Right next to the, the pinky shade. I got another lipstick. <laughs> it looks just like this. Kind of similar to the last one. The last lipstick I got is the shade Immortal. And this is a liquid lipstick, a matte liquid lipstick right here. Oh, yes, those are all the lipsticks that I received. I was gonna do a liner, but let me see what it looks like with the gloss. Oh, I don't need a lip liner. This is pretty. And it comes with a mirror. You see it says peel off? I'm gonna do that real quick, hold on. So I'm just gonna take the Mac Fix Plus right here and just set everything in place. Okay guys, so this is the end of the video. Um, I hope you liked my trying first impressions of new makeup uh, video. If you did, please be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to have 2,500 subscribers. I don't know why when, hopefully by the end of the year. Um, I'm gonna say the end of the year instead of the end of the month because technically December is the end of the year month. So <laughs> I'm just gonna say hopefully I can reach 2,500 by the end of the year. Leave a comment down below what you thought of this video. Did you like it? Did you hate it? I don't care. Leave some suggestions for some future videos and I'll be sure to make some videos regarding those suggestions. And that is pretty much all I have to say. Make sure you have your uh, post notifications turned on that way you're notified every single time that I upload. And that's basically it i hope you guys like this video and that's all i have to say have a good day and i'll talk to you guys in my next one peace